Hey, what's up guys? You boys, Pilot 2K7, and we are back for brand new Grand Auto 5 Firefighter Mod video. Today we're going to be showing off some brand new fire trucks from Medic4523. So Medic4523, he has made so many amazing emergency service vehicles for GTA 5. So before I start the video, I really want to say thank you for all of the work he has done for the community. It is definitely appreciated. So today we're going to be taking a look at his new E1 pack i know a lot of you guys are fans of e1 so i'm pretty sure you guys are gonna like this now it comes with uh six fire truck models so you have two engines you have two ladders both a aerial and a tower ladder and then you have two rescues so we're going to be going through all of those today and also spawn every single livery that they have as well that way you guys can get a a good picture on like all the different options that you could come up with so uh let's take a quick look like i said i spawned everything so we're here at the fire quarters headquarters <laughs> i said the fire quarters headquarters the fire department headquarters here in los santos as you can see and we have all of the fire trucks here now some of those skins have a uh, real life skin so you guys see this boston skin which looks really nice now we have a lot of fans up in Boston. You guys have been asking me to do a uh, Boston theme fire episode. And then we also have some Chicago uh, fire style skins as well over here. Now let's go through everything one by one guys. I'm going to start. Let's start with this heavy rescue. We'll just work our way around. So we'll like start here and we'll just go counterclockwise until we get all the way to Chicago so first up we have the Polito Bay Township Fire Department this is their rescue truck one cool and new feature I saw that medic implemented with this was having the rescue have uh, wheel chokes here so you kind of put those down or chucks to uh, block the wheels so make sure it doesn't roll away when you're on scene or whenever the vehicle is out of the firehouse so I thought that was a pretty cool thing since in real life a lot of departments do have a policy on placing those when you are on the scene but uh yeah let's go ahead and hop in and let's see what we are able to do with this truck very very nice now obviously you could change the lighting so you can make it all red if you like I, it's currently by default it's red and blue but very beautiful truck i like the livery on it and yeah now we could also let's see yeah if we put uh press alt and close bracket that puts on the scene lighting so we have 360 degree scene lighting here which is awesome if you do uh, open brackets, you also get your, I forgot what you call this, your cruise lighting, mainly used by police departments, but it's just a feature of ELS. Um, let's mess around with the extras. So like I was telling you guys, you could take away the uh, chucks on the wheels. So that's extra 10 if you like to take it away. And I wanna see something with the doors real quick. Yep, I figured that was gonna happen. So the trunk, the trunk is this light here. Very, very nice. That gives you even more lighting that you're able to work with. Ah, I thought I had this other thing that controls my doors. I'm gonna try to put it up and down. But yeah, that is very cool. Very, very nice. Trying to get rid of my turn signal. Okay, there we go. So very beautiful truck, and that is the heavy rescue. Very, very nice. We'll go ahead and hop out and we'll close all of these doors. Alright, perfect. I also like the uh, rear. I never seen a rescue like this before, like with the walk on from the side. That's pretty cool. Can we actually get up there? I don't know. It may not have a collision. Oh, crap. <laughs> we just broke it. Alright, I'll bring it back. That was Rescue 8A, so I'll just bring that right back. There we go. Wait, it had two skins? Or did I spawn the wrong one? Yeah, I spawned the wrong one. That was actually Rescue 8. Sorry, we're getting there, we're getting there. Alright, 
Okay, so rescue eight, and we had that skin. So you kind of can see, um, basically, this one over here is the same exact thing as that one, just two different skins. Um, so this one has like a San Andreas Medical Service skin on it, paramedics, EMS rescue two. Very nice, like a nice EMS heavy rescue. And of course, all of the lighting and stuff like that would be identical to that truck next up something that i thought was pretty cool we have los santos volunteers that is pretty interesting to see in the city kind of reminds me of there's like this one volunteer fire department in new york city i can't remember the name right now but it, it kind of reminds me of that because like when you think of los santos like this big city you wouldn't expect a city this big to have volunteers so it's kind of like new york city um I forgot where it's at. Though. I haven't been there in so so long. It's like it's near a beach, and like I think it's in Queens. Some of you guys may know. Just put it in the comment section. But yeah, it's like a small volunteer fire department out there, and um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So uh, let's take a look at this. And by the way, I wasn't saying that this was based off of their uh, fire trucks. I was just saying that it kind of reminded me of that like having a volunteer department in a big city but very nice I like the orange I'm definitely gonna use these in a video very different very nice beautiful I like the hydrant hook up there too with the E1 on it very nice let's take a look at the inside most of the insides are all the same, but very nice. Beautiful truck, yeah? All right, uh, let's mess around. The rest of the vehicles do not have any extras, but I think like with the doors, I believe you could put down, yep. So if you put down your trunk, that lowers the ladder, so you could kind of role play taking that off, which is pretty cool. And then of course, just put that right back up. You also have your same uh, scene lighting, so that lights everything up at night. And you got 360 degrees. Actually, no, just front and front and sides. All right, so that's that. Uh, next up, we have the ladder. Uh, same thing with the volunteers. It also comes with this Blaine Davis skin. A bit, another interesting skin with the lime green. Um, so I'm guessing this one does, I'm not sure, is it Blaine County and also Davis? Or I wonder if this is actually, is Blaine Davis a place? That's another question. I don't know, maybe that's a real place or maybe it's Blaine County and Davis neighborhood. I have no idea. I gotta look into that um, after the video. But here is the ladder. And as with all of Medic 4523 ladders, uh, I was gonna press O and make that come out. Alright, I may have to double check my outriggers are not working. Okay, I gotta double check the outriggers, but as you guys saw, the ladder does work. So we're able to extend that. Very, very nice. And then same thing, you got your scene lighting. And then you can also turn these lights on too. So with the ladders, you can kind of control them individually. So on, off, and then you can do the same thing with that, uh, which is pretty cool. Both is closed brackets, just closed brackets by itself or um, closed brackets with uh, the right alt will do that for you. All right, so again, like I was saying, the Blaine Davis skin, I'm really curious. I'm just going to look right now because I'm really curious if this is like a real place or if they mean Blaine County. I'm about to just Google this real quick. Blaine Davis Fire Department. Is it real? Oops. Okay, it doesn't seem like it. <laughs> so yeah, I guess it's Blaine County and Davis. That's your fire department. <laughs> But very nice. I like the lime green. I like stuff that's different, you know? So, it's really nice. It could still be based off a of department, too. But I just, I just don't know which department. But 
very, very nice truck. Um, here's our EMS rescue truck again. Again, this is the same as the first uh, rescue that we looked at across the street over there. Uh, next up, we have a different rescue truck. What's the difference between these two again? I'm trying to remember. I think one is like, oh yeah, one's bigger. So these have single rear wheels, or I shouldn't say that, single axle in the rear. And this one has duals. So this one's a little bit uh, bigger, more heavy duty, carry more s tools, more supplies. Now this one only comes with one skin, so it comes with the Los Santos Fire Department skin, but it does match that ladder over there as well, which is pretty cool, the tower ladder. Oh shit, I just drove forward with the wheels locked up. So this also has the same extra that you could uh, turn off to move those, and then I believe you could do the same thing with the lights by opening that trunk. Oops. Oh! I stand corrected. So this is a walk-in rescue. Even better. Oh, so on this one, the hood is the light up top and then the trunk is back here. Very nice. So I'm actually like trying this out all for the first time with you guys. I just like did a quick test just to like check extras and stuff like that, but I'm just trying this out as I'm showing it off. So we're both learning these trucks together and I will be doing videos with these um, coming up. So make sure you guys look out for that. Make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications. That way you know whenever I post a new video and also hit that like button as well. If you guys are excited for some more firefighter content coming up, uh, let's take a look in here. Very nice, 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 nice. All right, so that is the rescue. Uh, next up we have the tower ladder. Let's hop into this one. Again, I gotta double check my outriggers because I'm not sure. Maybe the button change? I know before it used to be, oh. <laughs> Take a look at this. So on this truck, um, since I was planning, don't tell anybody yet though guys, but if you guys are still watching the next firefighter video I'm gonna do, it's gonna be a Chicago fire style video. So because of that, I added, I changed and made the lights kind of green to make it look a little bit more like Chicago. I know they only use like one green lights, but the way, like GTA models are it, it, it like changes half of the lights but that's okay so this one wasn't meant to be like the Chicago style but since I changed it on this one it was originally set up as blue and red I just changed it to be green and red and um yeah definitely looking cool let's actually try putting up the bucket on that very nice let's take a look at our lights you know what <laughs> let me bring that in a little bit i want to see let's see we have lights up here and then we also have the lights there so i like how you can individually control them too that's pretty cool all right so that and then now this one so that's chicago ladder 14 now this one um is set up this one i I don't think I changed, did I change the lights? I don't remember. I think this one already came set up with the green lights already. It also has extras, so this one is pretty cool. You could change extra 10 is your hydrant, and extra 11 gives you um, this, I guess, like multiversal kind of thing, so you can spray water, which is beautiful. Very nice feature. Kind of reminds me of the uh, Spartan pack that Medic did like a year ago or so that also had that feature. I think you could, uh, wait. No, I don't think this one comes out. Let me check. Does it? Yeah, I didn't think so. What's opening? Something's opening. I don't know what. <laughs> Back 
Okay, so that is your Chicago Engine 50. We'll probably be using this in our next episode. I really want to try to stream this tomorrow. So now you guys kind of know what to expect in tomorrow's video or live stream. And again, if you guys are looking forward to some more firefighter action, definitely go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new and also turn on notifications. And again, huge shout outs to Medic4523. Make sure you guys um, check him out. Check out his Discord. I think we lost the truck there. We lost a couple of trucks, actually. But check out his Discord. Check out his Patreon page if you guys would like to support. Um, you can get access to some of his models early. You can also test some of his models and get access to his uh, testing room or early release room in his Discord. So great way to support him. Check him out on Patreon. And yeah, guys, that is going to do it for this one. So do me a favor. Um, let me know which truck or trucks are your favorite down below in the comment section. I think my favorite is the Chicago Engine 50. It just looks nice. Like we're going to have some fun with this. Wait, I didn't turn the lights on yet. Let's turn the lights on this. Oh, look at those rotators. Nice, nice, nice. See, this one had the one green light and then the one red light. So this one is set up like basically like the real thing. It, the two green lights on top, they was blue. I just changed them to be green. But um, yeah, it, it looks amazing, guys. I think, I think this is definitely my favorite. This is so awesome. <laughs> get ready to hear a lot of that tomorrow guys but yeah guys thank you so much for watching i really do hope you guys enjoyed this video um also if you need help installing these i did do a tutorial a while back the tutorial still applies to install this um medic 4523 made this extremely easy they all go into one dlc so you just download the dlc and then you can just download all of the different fire trucks packs so like this is all the e1 pack you just download them and drag them in and then there's like the pierce arrow pack there's a couple other packs that came out the same day he dropped this so look out for videos maybe next week i'm gonna go over some of his other new mods but anyway guys again thank you so much for watching it also check out my website too if you guys could check out my website it definitely is appreciated you guys can find me at acepilot2k7.com on, on my website, I have a bunch of tutorials, I have mod lists, I have merchandise, I also have a exclusive member only area, so if you become a member, you can also get some, um, you can also see some of my exclusive videos such as my behind the scenes content, you can see how I set up some of my more difficult and tricky scenario videos, also have a first access section where you can see some or really like a um, exclusive section so you can see some videos that are only on my website again acepilot2k7.com so thank you guys so much for watching really do hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next one peace